What is up guys? I think it is about time that I taught you another flourish. All right, guys, so if you're anything like me, you'd want to know what this is called. Well, let me tell you right now, I already have a name for it, so you don't even have to worry because it's called crisscross. Yep, it is called crisscross. So let's go ahead and break this down. So starting off, you're gonna be holding the deck in your non-dominant hand in an elevated straddle grip like so. You're gonna come over with your dominant hand, place your thumb on the bottom next to that pinky here. You're gonna take your middle finger, put it up top next to that index finger, and we're all set to go. So from this position, you're gonna break off about two thirds of the packet using your thumb here on the bottom, like so. So it's gonna look like this. This area here is kind of used as like a hinge. And on bottom here, you got that separation. Then up top, you're gonna to do something similar. You're gonna break off half the top packet using your middle finger up top here. So it's gonna look something like this. Now, once you're in this position here, you're gonna come over with your non-dominant thumb. You're gonna grab the center packet, right? So you see center packet here. You're gonna come grab the center packet and now you're actually gonna use your two thumbs to break the center packet into a top half and bottom half. So the two thumbs are gonna pull this packet apart. The dominant thumb will take the top half, non-dominant thumb will take the bottom half and it's gonna look like this. Now from this position, using your left or your non-dominant index finger as a pivot, you're gonna swivel both these cards around. So your thumb is gonna open kind of like a scissor cut this thumb right here, you can just take that around like this until the corners here are clear. You see those two corners right there? Corner one, corner two, until those corners clear. Bring it like this. Now you bring that original top packet back. Now it's below the original bottom packet and you could drop this down. So let's get there one more time. So here we are like so, boom, break this apart, boom. Now, as you bring this back, right, you drop this, you're also gonna start bringing this packet back as well. So as you drop, bring this packet back, and you're gonna grab it again with your dominant thumb. So we're here, like so, open like this, drop, come back, grab with this finger. So we're kind of back in our original starting point. So now that we're back in our original, uh, so now that, so now that we're, oh my God. So now that we're back at our original starting point, we're gonna come here, we're gonna curl in our ring finger here. So as we're, as we're here like this, we do this, this, this. The middle, or sorry, ring finger now will be curled in like this, holding this bottom packet. And you're just gonna drop this packet, this middle packet right here, right on top of that ring finger. And now these two fingers, your middle finger and pinky finger, will close on that packet. And now you have a grip on that packet with your ring finger, on bottom and your middle and pinky finger on top. So the next thing you're gonna do here is kinda just open this up kinda like a door. So boom, you open that up. Bam, look at that. Open up. So now from that position, once it's been opened up like this, you're gonna also move this packet, the original bottom packet, you're gonna move it up using your index finger and your thumb. So your index finger is gonna push up like so. And while this is happening, you're gonna come over with this packet you have in your dominant hand, and you're gonna push down on this packet here. So you're gonna be pushing down on this packet here and kind of bringing it underneath this original bottom packet like so. So hopefully you can see from this view, you can start to push down like so. So you can see this packet here is going on the bottom. So pushing that in, pushing that in. And now you bring that all the way down, right? So you can see that's all the way down. Now you're gonna close this original bottom packet on top of everything. So it's gonna look like this with the packet that you're holding with your dominant hand still sticking out like so. So getting to that position one more time, here we are. Boom, beep, bop, pow, I think. All right, so now that we're here, we're gonna come over. This is kind of held in a middle grip kind of instead of having your middle and ring finger up here, just have our middle finger up here and thumb on bottom. And now you're gonna come and pivot this packet around this top. So pivot around like this, and then it's gonna land on top of your thumb like so, being supported by your middle ring and pinky finger on this side. Okay, one more time. Here we go. Boom, beam, bop, boop, boop, boom. 
And now from here, you're gonna go into a biddle grip. So thumb on bottom, middle ring finger on top. You're gonna lift your thumb up. So instead of being resting here, you're gonna lift it up, lift up, and you're gonna twirl this packet around that thumb. Okay, once again, we're here, twirl around. And the way that we're twirling, we're in our middle grip here. We're gonna use, boom. Use your thumb here, down here. Thumb here, down here. Use your thumb down here, like this. And now it's facing the entire deck. And now one last thing you're gonna do, you're gonna come over with this bottom packet, push up, curl in your index finger, push up to open that up. It's also being supported by middle ring and pinky finger here. Pull up, let your non-dominant thumb grab this, pull this all the way down, and now you can close up using your dominant hand or these fingers. So boom, closed up. So everything together, split off into three packets, split the middle into two, do that crisscross, that's why it's called crisscross. Boom, close it there. Hold with your thumb, drop on top of that um, ring finger, open like a door, open this up as well, push down here, close the original bottom on top of everything, pivot this all the way around, twirl around your thumb like so, push the bottom packet, pull here, boom, and you're all set. That is crisscross. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this flourish and for more stuff like this, you can go check out that video right there. I'll see you there. Peace out.